Hey there movie fans, this time I'm going to show you my entire Quentin Tarantino collection uh, except National Born Killers because I consider that one more of a uh, Oliver Stone movie than a Tarantino movie and um, I've already did a video years ago of my very small National Born Killers collection and for those who are interested I will leave a link to that video below but uh, anyway, um, I'm going to do this in no particular order, and I'm going to start off with the box sets first. And the first one is Kill Bill Volume 1 and 2. Now this box set is from French. If I open it up, you see a picture there of Uma Thurman as the bride. And let's open up this one. Small foam in there, and it has the dead list. The Bride's Death List. Here's a, uh, a book. Which is written in French, as you can see. Oops, sorry for the glare there. Nice you know, book with some very nice pictures from the movie. This is uh, from the uh, the leader scene of um, I believe it's it's volume one or volume two. I'm not really sure about it. Not the easiest book to show on camera, though. Here's Tarantino with the Uma Thurman on the set of Kill Bill and here as well David Carradine Wu Ping, the uh, fight choreographer. Very nice little book there. And then you have these art cards, which are still, you know, inside these uh, this uh, little holder, I guess you can call them. They're very much like a like a photograph, you know, very glossy and all that. And of course you got the DVD set, which is still brand new, still in, in its original shrink wrap. This is a, um, a digi pack. And also in this original shrink wrap is the CD soundtrack. There's also some sort of a digi pack there. Next is the UK box set of Pulp Fiction, which comes in this yeah, briefcase, the shape of this briefcase. And inside is the menu card of Jack Rabbit Slims. And then you have the Big Kahuna Burger Bag. Inside the bag is the Blue A of Pulp Fiction. Comes in this uh, you know, regular uh, keep case. And then you have also these uh, you know, pictures inside this uh, plastic bag. A keychain of Pulp Fiction, that is the Z or Z keychain. And money. Not real money, of course. 
but Uma Thurman's character is on the uh, is on the uh, the money there. On the other side, we have Vincent Vega and Jules, you know, John Travolta and uh, uh, Samuel L. Jackson. This is the UK box set, the DVD box set of Reservoir Dogs. Here's the, uh, the front. Here's my number. I don't know exactly how much of these has been made. Could be 10,000, but I'm not really sure about that. Anyway, let, let's see what's inside this box set. You have these um, art cards and, and, and you know, uh, quotes, cards. The DVD of Reservoir Dogs. And a book, Quentin Tarantino, The Man and His Movies by Jamie Bernard. I actually read this uh, a long time ago, and it's really good uh, little book, this one. Next up is this Japanese box set of Kill Bill Volume 1. And this uh, version contains the... Um, the color version of the uh, you know the fight scene between uh, the bride and um, uh, the crazy 88 you know the the other versions are in um, black and white but this is the only one that is in color let's come with a, a little bullet there some art cards and some other good stuff and then you have this little katana, little samurai sword, which is still uh, brand new. And there's this little, um, uh, if I can get it out, a little action figure inside of the bride. Well, action figure. I don't, I don't know exactly how you call these things. But uh, anyway, there's a nice little extra there. And you also have a t-shirt that uh, Uma Thurman wears in the, in the movie. And here is the Japanese box set of Kill Bill Volume 2. Pretty much, you know, pretty much the same as, uh, as the first one. Um, now the, the, there is some scenes, some extra scenes uh, um, in this Japanese version that are not in the other versions. Uh, it's you know the moment where the bride is meeting um, the pimp. I don't I don't know what his name is, but he's played by uh, Michael Parks. You know he start, he goes to the pimp to ask where Bill is, and then you have, he's surrounded by these uh, prostitutes, of course. And there's just a small, a couple of shots, extra shots in that uh, in this version that are not in the other versions. Here is a, um, a little booklet, by the way. Which, obviously, as you can see, is written in Japanese. And then you have these kind of things, these um, art cards. I believe this, uh, each of these cards uh, introduce um, uh, a character from the movie. And then you have this kind of things again. This is a, a keychain. And uh, what's inside here? Oh, there's nothing. <laughs> and there's a little case. Now, oh, there's another one of those toy figures inside the coffin, you know, just like in the movie. And again, another t-shirt. And here is the Italian box set of, uh, the DVD box set of uh, From Dusk Till Dawn. And I know that um, Tarantino did not direct any of these films, but he did wrote the first one and he executive produced uh, 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 
the sequels and of course he also starts in the first one playing one of the gecko brothers and here is um, a very beautiful very detailed maquette of the titty twister I really like how they've uh, how they've done that it's pretty heavy as well and this is what the back looks like really love how they've done that it looks really good doesn't it and inside this you have the uh, DVD box set with all three movies in there oh there's also some uh, some art cards as you can see Selma Hay Hay Hayek 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 anyway this is uh, the first one also can includes the uh, documentary Full Tilt Boogie Ooh, one of them is loose yeah, I hate when it happens very very nice box set and it also has a t-shirt with the Italian title of um, From Dust Till Dawn. This is the German tin case, which looks like a gasoline tin case of uh, Dead Proof, the other half of the Grindhouse movie. I also have one of uh, Planet Terror, but I'm not showing that one because, you know, it, it's more of a uh, Robert Rodriguez film even though Tarantino has a small cameo in it uh, Let me show you what's inside you have this um, well, whatever this is um, A promotional CD An art card And the DVD set which is ah, Here we go And there's nothing else in there Here's Kurt Russell, and there are the two DVDs. And here we have the Blu-ray box set Tarantino XX, celebrating 20 years of filmmaking. I love the, the artwork on this set, by the way. And uh, this is, uh, you know, this was on the back of the uh, the box set with information about the movies comes to this very nice ditchy pack and of course here you have the disc Reservoir Dogs, True Romance, Jackie Brown, Pulp Fiction and then here you have Kill Bill Volumes 1 and 2 Dead Proof, Inglorious Bastards, and two bonus disc. It's a really, really great uh, Blu-ray box set, this one. Uh, here we have a limited edition DVD set of Pulp Fiction. Uh, it also comes with the... Um, well, this is, this is not the official CD soundtrack there's only a couple of songs on uh, on there you know the original uh, soundtrack has a lot more songs of course there's Bruce Willis this comes oh, this excuse me this comes uh, you know this, on the back of the uh, of the set and then you have this advertisement folder with all the other releases and things like that and then you have a booklet of the movie and a film cell. Let me give you a clear. Uh, here it is, John Travolta. And of course, it's got the DVD in there as well. Next is the UK uh, tin case of Reservoir Dogs, which is similar as the uh, the Dead Proof one. 
and I already took out the the contents because it was it was very difficult to get them out. Here's a uh, advertisement of the video game Reservoir Dogs, and uh, this was on the back, and here are the DVDs. Uh, here I have the uh, Dutch steel book of Reservoir Dogs. Those come with the um, a lot of extras. If I can get them out, uh, here we go. There's a uh, Michael Madsen as Mr. Blonde, and there's a uh, a booklet right here, written in uh, in Dutch. And you have these, uh, you know, art cards of each of the characters from the movie, and a quote of the of the character. And here is the American DVD of Reservoir Dogs. You know, back in the day, you had um, these different um, um, slip cases of these, um, you know, each each of these characters. Well, I've chosen this one because this is my really my favorite character of the movie, Mr. Blonde, played by Michael Madsen. I was caught with this uh, small booklet there. And here is the two-disc DVD. Uh, True Romance, obviously not directed by Tarantino, uh, even though he wanted to. Uh, you know, he wanted. It, it was the first screenplay that he had written, and he wanted to direct it, and he was looking to finance the movie, but he couldn't do it, so he went on another project, which was um, Reservoir Dogs, I believe, and the rest is history. But it's still a great film, this one. You know. Tony Scott did a, a terrific job at uh, directing this film. Absolutely love this film. Uh, this is Four Rooms, which is a, an anthology movie that Tarantino has directed, along with Robert Rodriguez, Alison Anders, and Alexander Rockwell. It's okay. It's a nice movie. Then here is the uh, season five finale of CSI, uh, Grave J Danger which was directed by Tarantino. The American DVD set of Jackie Brown, the collector's edition. The other DVDs. And there's also some extras inside, like this little poster there. Which is um, basically a sort of black exploitation style poster, as you can see. Love the movie. Really great for film, this one. Uh, these are just advertisement folders. And here's the, uh, the booklet. Uh, from Dust Till Dawn, this is the UK DVD set. Also comes in this um, digi pack with a booklet inside, the DVD of the movie and the DVD of uh, Full Tilt Boogie, which is um, you know the, uh, the the making of documentary of uh, From Dust Till Dawn. And then I have this pretty. Uh, grindhouse DVD set from Japan this looks really good I, I, this is long out of print now I don't know if you could I mean you, you could still get it but I don't know if it's still if it's expensive could be but this is really really great how they've done that you know like a like a vinyl you know like an old-fashioned LP um, yeah you have a uh, that proof on here with the movie and then the one with the uh, bonus material 
Then you have uh, Grindhouse itself, you know, the three hour long version. And this is the Japan, Japan Special Disc, which I believe is a bonus disc. And of course you have Planetary on here with some other stuff. All advertisements as you can see. Here it is, the movie and the bonus disc. And it's a really great set, isn't it? Really love uh, how they have done that. And this is Sin City. Um, of course it's more of a film by uh, Robert Rodriguez and uh, uh, Frank Miller but uh, Tarantino did direct one scene you can see the special guest director Quentin Tarantino and this one has the, um, yeah, the two DVDs and it has this little thing Oh, advertisement. And it has one of the graphic novels uh, by Frank Miller, The Heart Goodbye. And speaking of Sin City, I also got the Blue Ray Steelbook. This is from uh, Canada, by the way. And this one is from the UK, which is still in its original shrink wrap, by the way. But this one uh, contains the um, the extended version of uh, Sin City, which is not on that one. Well, I will open it one day. Here we have uh, Inglorious Bastards. This is the um, um, Canadian steelbook. And this is the UK steelbook, I believe, of From Dusk to Dawn. Dead proof, just a regular Blu-ray, as you can see. The German steelbook of Grindhouse. The UK steelbook of Django Unchained. Uh, this is the uh, the American, uh, you know, Target exclusive Blu-ray with the um, uh, bonus disc of The Hateful Eight. With the lenticular cover, as you can see. And here is the Canadian steelbook of Kill Bill Volume 1. And Kill Bill Volume 2. And here's the UK set, a Blu-ray set of Inglorious Bastards. Which comes with the um, the Blu-ray, obviously, and it also comes with these um, art cards. Now, this is a very be beautiful one. I'm gonna show show. Now, this, of course, is a poster from uh, from the movie, a non-existent movie, of course. Fraulein Doctor. And this is the um, Japanese poster. And there's another one of those film posters that was used in, in the movie. And a recipe. A Nazi recipe. How nice is that? <laughs> and here are the soundtracks. This one is of Reservoir Dogs. Pulp Fiction, Jackie Brown, Kill Bill Volume 1, Kill Bill Volume 2, Dead Proof, Inglorious Bastards, uh, oops. The Django Unchained. This comes with this um, digi pack. You know, the CD is inside, and in here is the booklet.
And the last one is the Hateful Eight. And I also got some screenplays, you know, in the, these uh, these forms of little books. Uh, you know, reading Tarantino's screenplays is actually as entertaining as watching his movies, really. So we got the Pulp Fiction. Oop, excuse me. Reservoir Dogs. Uh, this is a uh, true romance. The Hateful Eight. Jackie Brown. Dead Proof. From Dusk Till Dawn. And here is, I actually got this um, from from the internet, I you know, printed this from the internet, the screenplay of Kill Bill. And the screenplay of Django Unchained. And last but not least, I have a couple of uh, Kill Bill action figures here. This one is of the bride. And here we have Gogo Jubari. And Quentin Tarantino himself dressed as one of the crazy 88. This is one of those special edition, or limited edition, I believe. With blood spraying extra. Action, excuse me, action. And he looks exactly not like Tarantino, as you can see. And that's it for my Tarantino collection. It's quite a lot, isn't it? Um, yeah, that is it. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll talk to you next time. Bye.